Hey guys, welcome back to some more Broken Age. Let's go and save the Mario people. Ah, the young master has come to pay with the space weaver. Where shall we go today, wise commander? Oh man, a real mission for once. This is so fun. This is serious, Shay. Stay focused. You can hear everything I say? Yes. Please don't say anything embarrassing. Like, fuck you? Uh. Hey, Space Weaver. Want a little robot friend? There is no room in the Space Weaver's life for friendship. He slides alone, like a shuttle of yarn, across the warp of time, on an ever shortening thread. Yeah, that's cool. Gary's a loner too, so. <laughs> Lame. I don't think that needs any here. Nah, he might have germs. I hope you're not talking about me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what the fuck? Let's see. What can we click next? Like... Gary doesn't want to grab that. He dislikes the texture of synthetics. What? What is this? Mass Effect? Synthetics. I don't think that needs any here. I think a real knitting tool would be better. If I give the Space Weaver a star chart, he'll weave the destination pattern into this nav scarf. Climb up. Let's see what's... Hey, Space Weaver, let's go somewhere exciting for a change. I have been programmed to take the young master wherever he desires, as long as it is safe and free of conflict. Ah. Bring me a star chart, and the fabric of time and space shall be meant to serve your passage. Thank you. Let's... Put in the star chart. Some stars on this star chart do seem to correspond to the nav scarf pattern. What? Uh, let's give it to him. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? It would be elementary. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Wolf. Intake calipers in position. Weave thrusters at viscosity. Spindle at rotational velocity. Deploying nav scarf in five, four, three, two, one. Everybody make it in one piece. Great. Why? It was supposed to happen. Something else? Hey, Space Weaver. Let's go somewhere exciting for a change. I have been programmed. Ah, blah, blah. No. Where can we go? Let's go here. Better not go out there while the ship's in high alert mode. Well, we just left. Where can I go now? If I give the Space Weaver a star chart, he'll weave the destination pattern into this nav scarf. So, where am I supposed to go? Go back? We should be in the Talon Nebula now. Great work, young cub. We're approaching the location of the distress signal now. <laughs> this is worse than I thought. The good news is their captors have left them unguarded for the time being. What can I do? Here, take these controls.
You need to lower the shield so the boom arms can be extended. What? Go on, lower the shield. Uh, how am I? Good. Now wait until the boom arm is correctly positioned above the subject, then press this to it. I got it! Great work, Shay. Now the boom arms will haul it in and place it in the auxiliary cargo hold. I should go see if it's okay. No. They must remain in complete quarantine for their own protection. And ours. You mean, our diseases might kill them? You are wise for such a young cub. Now we must save more quickly before their captors return. Use the movement controls to position the ship. <laughs> this is kind of creepy. <laughs> uh, Careful. Maybe. Wait for it. Got another one. Great. Now just place it in the cargo hold and. Oh no. What is it? Hostile forces have been detected nearby. They're coming in our direction. We need to retreat. Not yet. There's still one more to save. No time. We have to pull out immediately or we'll be destroyed. No! You didn't tell me I'd have to pick who lived and died. You want to be a grown-up? Get used to making tough decisions. No time to mourn. There's another distress signal. This one's from Danger System 5. Are you up to it? Shay, are you the master of your feelings or are they the master of you? Give me the star chart. What? Travel? That that was all? How can I see those uh, those guys that I saved? They're still on the map. Excuse me, Merrick, what are you doing? There's no time to waste. Take that vent to the navigation room and give that star chart to the space weaver right now. Yeesh. Okay, now let's give this this. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? With pleasure. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. So wolf drive. Calipers in position. Oh man. Leave thrusters at viscosity. This cost me what? Deploying nav scarf in five, four, three, two, one. This looks like the place. You sure? Looks kind of weird outside. I hear there are only four systems more dangerous. I hear there are only four systems yes, yes. more dangerous. Move. Okay, we should be in danger system five. Are we ever? Take a look at this. Look at what? What am I supposed to do now? Careful. Excellent. Securing what subject in cargo hold. What is this? Mario Brothers. What? Wait for it. Great work. Don't wait forever, though. Good. But hurry, we're running out of time. What? There's a time thingy on here that I'm missing. Oh, come on. Just push the button. Whoops. Rats. Yes. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, that's enough. What do you mean that's enough? I mean, enemy ships are approaching. I don't see anything. I need to save this last one. You're going to endanger the whole mission to save one creature? Just give me a second. 
This is a waste of time. Come on. There is just no like... need for this. Okay, I got it. But something's wrong. Cut it loose. We need to retreat before... Before what? Attention, ship is under attack. What happened? Probably one of the enemy vessels I warned you about, remember? We need to get that last creature. Too late. The ship is retreating under autopilot to a safe location. And we're completely locked out of the controls. Yeah. How are we going to perform any more rescues? We'll have to find another way to hack into the boom arm controls. And another way to bring the shields down at the right time. And who knows if we'll be able to navigate to the right system now that the ship's on high alert. The ship's computer must be freaking out right now. Oh, yes. <laughs> as soon as the alarm sounded, the first thing she probably did was check on you and your... What, going back to bed? Shay! Shay! Are you hurt? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. Um, something attacked the ship, but Mommy's taking care of it. Nothing to worry about, okay? Ah, <sighs> oh, so brave. Whew. Better get back to Merrick to hear his plan. That was kind of creepy. Oh, that guy is spying on me. Ship under attack. Everything's fine. Well, you're half right. Young cop, you must come see me right away. Oh man, you're creepy. <laughs> man. Oh my god, that was so fucking weird. Let's see, what's door behind door number one? Oh, this I haven't seen this room before. Ah creepy. Holy shit! He's following me. Stop following me. Oh, what is this? What is, what is this? Son, I'm not sure it's safe enough for you to leave your room. Tired of being a prisoner in my room. I'm sick of being a prisoner on this ship. I know, son. I know it's hard. You've given up so much. Listen, I'd like to tell you a story. A story of another person your age. A young girl. She wanted to live a normal life, but she was chosen. She was honored with a special duty. Some people would call it a sacrifice, but what she didn't realize at the time was that it was a great honor. Please, I've heard the story of the Sacrifice Girl a million times. I know the ending. The sacrifice Girl is you, right? What I'm trying to tell you is that I made a hard choice, but I regret nothing because... What? Great story, computer. I'm sorry they programmed you with someone's sad memories, but I have to go. You know the truth deep down, son. And I know you'll appreciate my words someday. Uh-huh. What? You mean this is Vela? You gotta be joking, right? Now I'm back here. Okay, now let's see where can I go from here? Climb up here. Yes, my love. Where are you where the universe was it work? Computer, were you aware that the universe and that helpless creatures are being terrorized by ruthless tyrants? Ooh, that sounds like a fun new game. 
I'll talk to the Yarn Pals and get that set up for the next round of missions. Would you like that? <sighs> Never mind. Computer, what's the point of all this? Son, you know how important Operation Dandelion is. Our home, Laruno, was dying, so we set sail in the Bassa Nostra to travel the universe and find you a new home. What? Why haven't we found a new home yet? Well, the universe is a big place, and it has to be perfect for my baby. We need to get to Prima Doom immediately. Computer, we need to get to Prima Doom immediately. Absolutely not. They call it Prima Doom for a reason. Why not have some fun in the smile system instead? What? Is there anybody else on this ship? It's just you, me, and your father, of course. Oh, are you feeling lonely? I could meet you some new friends. Knit? What? What? Those things from the ice cream thingy me jiggy were. N oh my god. So, you've never seen a strange wolf around? Son, I can't keep track of all your yarn pals. Oh, are you saying you'd like a little wolf friend? Well, I've never knit a wolf before, but it should be no problem. So, what does dad do during the day? Oh, your father has a lot of work to do outside, you know? Fixing the hull, scraping off space parasites, keeping a lookout for new planets to live on. Well, I gotta get back to taking over the... <laughs> oh, sweetie, you're so funny. What? What was that all about? Let's see, what this door is gonna lead me to... What is this place? Door number one, door number two, door number three. Let's see. Teleporter, activate. Yes, sir. To the Hall of Heroes? You mean the junk room? Yeah. This is kind of... This is kind of weird. <laughs> i never seen this part of the ship. Hey, my... my head. What's wrong? My head is smaller. Oh, uh, yeah, you just used a teleporter. Why did my head shrink? Quantum physics, duh. Don't worry, it'll all go back to normal when you take the trip back through me. Big baby. <laughs> Big baby. <laughs> ah, the head's the same. I don't see anything. How did I manage to win second place that time? Hey, the helmet comes off. Ah, my first hazard suit. Kept out Omicron radiation and kept in diaper leaks. Oh, what the fuck? Can't touch them. Bulletproof archive glass. She bronzed my first space shoes. Or is that the remains of my old bomb squad bot? I wish she'd get rid of these. My paper mache is so much better than that now. What? I gave up making art years ago. If no one's around to see it, who cares? I never want to see another train as long as I live. I made a hexipal out of a paper plate. Probably thought they were alive then. I wonder what's in those creepy jars. My old teeth? Hair? That should be for acting. Acting like I cared about the stupid missions on this ship. <laughs> oh, what is that? Who? This is weird. Where am I supposed to go? What is this? Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. Who? I found his secret the lair. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. Wish I could let them out. But it's for their own safety, I guess. Oh. Let's see, what's Merrick up to? But that's gonna continue in the next video, so see you guys next time.